Hello and welcome to this week's vlog. This is going to be the first scuba dive vlog in God knows how long and I am with Papa Bear. He's over there somewhere and uh, we're going to get geared up. We're going to get in the water with our O3 dry suits. I can't wait to get this underway. I mean like I've had this itch for scuba diving since we were on lockdown and man it's going to happen today. So where we are is a place called the Bridges of Ross. It's an absolute beautiful location. It's very popular for campers and tourists to come along here. I mean it's the pinnacle of the diving spots here on the Loophead Peninsula and you got Loophead Lighthouse just out the road. I'll leave a link to last week's vlog, it could have been last week or the week before that, up here to see what we got over there. I mean the place is unbelievable. Um, but yeah, so we're going to get our camera, the ESR with the Nightmare housing in under the water and see how that's going to perform. We had one dive with it since we bought it back in uh, March and that was the last time in the water, March 17th man. And it's now July. Second, third, fourth, something like that. All right, let's get packed up and let's get going, yeah?
All right, so the dive is well and truly over. We're back on dry land. I've had a bit of grub because I was so fun, so freaking hungry. Um, nearly let a curse word out. Um, it was a good dive overall. Wasn't the best in the world simply because it was a bit of accommodative errors. So many things went wrong in the dive, well, in the preparation to the dive, that even our dive time really got pushed way, way back. So for some reason on account, one of the Canon ESRs, some like error 20 came up. So I was a bit worried about that and a few other bits and bobs. Then on the Osmo Pocket, I forgot to put the uh, kind of silica gel strip in so it wouldn't fog up, but yeah, it fogged up. But overall, look, it's okay. I got into the water, I got wet, I got to use my O3 dry suit, which is freaking amazing. I mean, like, I'm dry, even my hands are dry. Got these special Kubi gloves, they're unreal. And uh, it really kind of made my dive that more enjoyable because I had a Scuba Pro dive dry suit and it was fine, but it leaked quite often and it didn't make for a nice dive half the time. So look, two for two with the O3 dry suit so far, I couldn't be happier. All right, so guys, thank you very much for watching this episode. I know it's not too long, but um, look, if you've liked it, do press the like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to see more of these videos, do press the notification bell down below and you'll be notified of more future videos. All right, so we'll see you in the next episode. Hey, yo. I'm going to be taking over for the Dear Meadow Donovan vlogs. So I just uh, dropped them off down there. Oh, how do I flip it? There we go, okay. And now I'm gonna go down this way to a little pool and go swimming. I don't know which way I'm going, but yeah, I will see you when we get down there. Ayo! So I just got down here and uh, it didn't take me very long. I'm just gonna reflip this, there we go. And that's it. It looks quite deep, but we're gonna go in anyways because I really need to pee. So I'll see you when I get out. I've decided not to go in because uh, there's actually a lot of sea urchins. I don't trust that I'll be able to get back out myself. And I saw fish and I'm a little bit scared, so. I hope these vlogs aren't wasting your, your batch. Oh wait, it is kinda, well, I'll, 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 uh, I'll stop. No, I, I'll do a couple more vlogs because I need to, I'm taking over for Dear Mother Donovan. So I'm not going, I'm gonna go over by uh, the, the normal part instead. Well, I'm actually liking this vlogging thing, I won't lie. And I, I'm going swimming because I got a new wetsuit. A scuba one. I've got to test it out. So, yeah. I don't even know if these videos are audible actually, but if not, that's really embarrassing. And there's people coming now, so I'm gonna turn this off. No offense, honey. Well, what do you know? My 15 year old didn't just pick it up off the ground. Monkey see, monkey do. And let's be honest, I'm pretty proud of her. She could be YouTube's next superstar.